The rock lime really does take quite a bit of time to dry because it's non-porous. And so then what we're going to do is look for our little scissors. I've got two pairs of gingers here. I've got a little um, embroidery pair and I've got this um, larger pair. Little ones won't be so good for doing these big straightaways. I'm going to get my glasses on. going to be careful. You want to take your time with this? Because you don't want, this is what's going to make it look sharp. Okay, you leave the detail work for the little scissors. I've got my topper that's base coated. Um, working on that. I'll be showing you that next. Okay, and so then when we get with these flaps right here like this, let's just go ahead and get them out of the way. when you're feeling patient because it's not hard it's just a patient thing okay so then that goes there I think I will just cut out the big stuff here time for me to get my gingers um, sharpened Got a little knot or something them from, I think I've got some crap on them, like I cut something that was wet. Okay. You want to cut right on the edge of your line, like right on that line. Okay. Get rid of these things. And then I come in for the detailed work. This is where some good light is very good. You don't want the blue showing on the other side of the leaf. So you actually kind of want to cut on the, um, on the leaf just a little bit so that you don't have blue showing because that will be ugly. Ask me how I know. And then you can bend that back. Like once you bend it up, it'll act like it wants to stay there. Um, just re-bend it back to where you want it to be. You can straighten up any edges, clean stuff up. Don't do too much because you're probably better off not fussing too much with this. Okay, and I am not going to cut this whole thing out on camera. That would be silly. However, I think I'm just about there. I'll show you a little bit of detail and so you can see kind of where we're going. All right, so that's what we're after is this lovely cut leaps floating off the edge of the world. 